To install Nessa in Kali Linux for vulnerability scanning, first open up your browser, go to Google, and type in Nessus download, press enter, click on the link where it says download tenable Nessus, or you can find the link in the description box too. Here from version, it will already be pre-selected. From platform, select Linux Debian AMD64. So the platform should be Linux Debian AMD64. Press download, click on I agree and your download will start. After your download is finished, go back to your terminal, change to the downloads directory and you can see the file has been downloaded. From here type in dpkg space dash i and the name of the file. Press enter. You have to be root for this. Type in your password for the machine and your installation will start. After the installation has completed, type in sudo systemctl start nessus d and press enter. To check whether the service has started or not, type in sudo systemctl status nessus d and press enter. Here I can see the status of the service is now active and running. Now go to your browser and type in https colon forward slash forward slash localhost colon 8834 and press enter. Here you need the HTTPS in front of the localhost because this requires a SSL certificate. Click on advanced, click on accept the risk and continue and you will be in this page. From here do not do anything for now, open another tab, go to google and type in Nessus Essentials and press enter. Click on the link where it says Tenable Nessus Essentials Vulnerability Scanner. You can find this link in the description box too. Here you can see under the register for an activation code, I need the business email. To open a business email, go to Google and type in temp mail and click on enter. This link will also be in the description box. Click on the link of temp mail. Here I'll get a temporary email address to register for my business account. Copy this email, go back to your activation code page, type in the first name, the last name and paste in the business email and click on get started. Here I have already done this before that's why it's showing me an email hourly limit rate. But for you, if you go to the temp mail page again, here you will see that you get the activation code. Copy this activation code here and save it. After this, go back to your browser. You don't need these tabs anymore. Close them. From here, you have the option to register offline or you can change the configuration settings too. I will not do that for now. I'll simply click on continue. Here, click on register for Nessus Essentials. There are other paid versions too. I'm only going for the free version. This, you can scan up to 12 IP address. Click on continue. Since I already have the activation code, I don't need to do this step. So I'll click on skip. And when it asks me for the activation code, go back to your terminal, copy the code, come back and paste in the activation code, click on continue and your license has been granted, click on continue, type in your username and password, click on submit and now it will start downloading the plugins, wait for the plugins to get downloaded. After the plugins are downloaded, you can click on the new scan button. Click on the new scan button, type in your username and password. And now you can do vulnerability scaling with your Nessus. Please let me know down in the comment section if you have any questions. And also please do not use this for illegal activities. Thank you so much for watching the video.